Hi everybody, nice to see you here. The community has asked, and here it is, a fun tutorial to learn the glitch basics. If you are opening your menu, you will find many cables that we have actually, even a pipe. But what is of interest to us is the electrical wiring. Okay, with this we're going to glitch build. We can actually choose the cable straight from the menu and this is how it looks like when you uh, pull it out. So you can place it more or less anywhere. It's green stated as you can see. So we place it here to the side and place it again. Now in build camera, which is the best way to build by the way, if you have a look at it, it's flashing, has like a symbol in it and uh, if you approach it, it turns to uh, a green ball with uh, a circle around it. Depending to where you place the cable, the arrangement, everything else, of course, the symbol inside is going to uh, change and you can, let's say, connect it here, pull a cable. That's the original use of a cable, of course. Now, I must say, uh, I really like to use the pill light. This is my favorite. Uh, I like to work with the pill light. It's just uh, crazy, amazing how you can use the pill light. But of course, the original use of cables is there to connect items uh, in your menu. If you open your menu, you will see that actually we have many items that need power to work properly okay this is of course the original use but this is not what we're going to do today you're going to learn how to glitch build with the cables in your build menu you're going to find many items that either turn red because they need to be built under water or they need to be built at a certain point or you don't have the materials so it turns out red. Of course we can change that. If you're toggling a triangle Y or Q depending where you're playing from then you will switch from the item to the cable as you can see it here and this is how we are starting to glitch build guys. Toggle from the item to the cable and approach the pill light and it will look like this when it's ready, okay? So at the same time, more or less, you press the two buttons shown on your screen and voila, here you have it, a underwater item glitched out of the water onto a pill light. Really actually kind of cool, right? So let's say we choose something else, a door, it's red here, okay, everywhere, should connect over there actually, but not here and not in there either. But don't forget, you just toggle again from the item to the cable and then you approach the pill light inside there and press at the same time the buttons and voila again, you have a door inside there. A perfect little space all private for a little geck and if you connect it here to a power source it's going to open and close accordingly guys actually kind of fun right whenever you are done building okay you can take off the pill light you just choose it and you delete the pill light and then it's gone and it looks great all right now, how about something else like this lamp, okay? Now, okay, sure, I have another one already. If I toggle it, uh, I can connect it to these cables, but why not actually connect it to the other lamp, okay? And it's actually kind of fun to connect uh, different items uh, onto each other. As you can see, I can continue connecting then onto the lamp I already uh, have uh, placed there and it actually is stacking one on top or close to uh, the other one. So if you continue doing this, you get a fun kind of lamp and as you can see, 
the connector points are perfectly aligned in a specific spacing that you might use actually for something else. Now I can connect anything here, glitch it, but please have a close look at to where the symbol is pointing inside the circle. This is uh, the direction it's going to be glitched. Like here it's on the side because the cable is placed on the side and the fun part is I can then glitch also at the same point something else inside that bubble pipe. Another cool way is to glitch let's say a prefab onto the pill light, okay? Let's uh, open it, make a door and as you can see the pill light and the point of connection is still there. Now if I go into my menu and let's say I choose the uh, aquarium here, okay? Then you will see aquarium you can place just like that. It's green stated, it needs no glitching. But don't forget, we still have the connection point and maybe the fishes would like to have something else inside their aquarium. That kinda looks cool, right? So, in your build menu, you're going to see that many items do connect uh, very normal and without a problem to your prefabs, like this ramp, okay? It just connects outside and you can green state it like this. But, I mean, come on guys, I don't like this uh, that way. It's going downward. Is there a better way? Oh yeah, you bet. Remember, your best friend, the pill light. So just glitch the ramp onto the pill light, a nifty little thing that E.R. Burroughs showed me a very long time ago and I still love uh, this. It really looks cool and you have a perfectly straight walkway that you can use in many ways. Now let's add something else at the bottom, okay? Um, well, I mean, whatever you want to do with it. But of course you're going to tell me, hey Nirvana, I am going to trip over that pill light when I'm walking to my home. So simple, just take it off, okay? And the walkway will stay, right? Perfect. Now let's add something else. Like everybody likes windows, right? <laughs> so let's add windows. As you can see, they simply connect very easily the green state, you know, where you want to have them. But of course, you're going to ask me, well, is there another way how to use windows? And yes, guys, there is. Now, have a look at this exactly. If you have a setup like that, with the cubes, you add pill lights, okay? You can then add the windows in between here. This is also a very cool thing that is around for a very, very long time. You can build your own stuff with that and it protects you also if you do it right. It was shown to me by uh, Action Pants Gaming and uh, yes, it has been a while ago that this uh, uh, actually works. Now, please note the pill lights are here and you can still see them. You can add stuff. You can take, let's say, the cubes out. Okay, so they're solely standing. But there is a problem, guys. If you have noted, you see here, the pill light is gone. So depending how you're placing the pill light and where, whenever you take something off, if you're unlucky, a pill light is going to disappear, okay? So please note that. Uh, not everything stays uh, depending to the pill lights. Now, of course, uh, we can connect uh, otherwise other things to the pill lights let's say uh, on, on a wall, which actually kind of looks cool here. I just love that. You can place it anywhere you like. To the end of this tutorial, I'm showing you the reverse wire glitch. It's very useful, specifically if you want to find a middle point of an item like this panel, okay? So you green state it, press the buttons at the same time more or less and then you just place the cable to the side of that panel. 
then you replace it okay and you do the same thing on the other side okay just copy the panel green state it you press both uh, buttons at the same time more or less and you should get the cable okay this cable you simply pull then towards the middle of the first panel and you connect it okay once you have that you will see that the cable is going exactly straight through the middle of the panel you take off then the excess cable okay and you have a perfect middle point if i build from this point on usually i take off the first panel because the build can come out wobbly depending to what you do afterwards so i just glitch on a fresh panel onto the point but be careful guys as you will see here if you're not careful you're landing on top of the cable and it will green state so you have to make sure guys that you are connecting it and glitching it onto the end of the cable make sure it sits in the middle and voila you're done guys i hope you had lots of fun working with me in this basic tutorial and i hope to see you next time yes happy building guys bye bye